Today, we're diving deep into the world of Samsung's mid-range chips. For years, they've been playing catch up, but it looks like things are changing rapidly. Let's talk about the potential game changer, the upcoming Exynos 1580. Samsung's mid-range chips used to be, let's just say, not the best. They were often outperformed by competitors. But over the past few years, there's been a noticeable improvement. With chips like the Exynos 1380 showing promise, it's clear Samsung is stepping up their game. Now, get ready for this. There's a strong possibility that Samsung is cooking up something truly special, the Exynos 1580. Rumor has it, this chip could rival the mighty Snapdragon 888, a flagship chip from 2021. That's a bold claim, but the evidence is starting to pile up. Recently, a mysterious Samsung chip with the codename S5E 8855 popped up on Geekbench. All signs point to this being the Exynos 1580. Let's break down the numbers. This chip boasts an impressive 8-core CPU configuration with a mix of performance and efficiency cores. It managed to score a respectable 1,146 points in single-core and 3,678 points in multi-core tests. That's putting it on par with the Exynos 2100 and Snapdragon 888, which were top-tier chips in their day. But it's not just about raw CPU power. The Exynos 1580 is rumored to come equipped with Samsung's Sclips 540 GPU. This is a significant upgrade from the Sclips 530 found in the Exynos 1480. And get this, it's believed to be based on AMD's RGA3 architecture, the same tech powering the Galaxy S24's Exynos 2400. If that's true, we're looking at some serious graphics performance. Based on leaks, the Exynos 1580 is said to feature four Cortex, a 720 and four Cortex, a 520 cores. It's internally codenamed Santa. While the core configuration looks promising, the real test will be in real-world performance and efficiency. We're hoping Samsung has managed to address the overheating issues that have plagued some of their previous chips. On the connectivity front, we can expect the Exynos 1580 to be packed with features. Since the Exynos 1480 already supports 5G Wi-Fi sticks, Bluetooth 5.3, and NFC, it's safe to assume the 1580 will at least match those specs. As for the manufacturing process, while Samsung is pushing the boundaries with its 3M process, it's unlikely the Exynos 1580 will be built on that node. So there you have it, folks. The Exynos 1580 is shaping up to be a serious contender in the mid-range chip market. If Samsung can deliver on the promise of performance, efficiency, and features, we could be looking at a real game changer. We'll keep a close eye on developments and bring you updates as soon as we have more concrete information. And remember, if you're in the market for a new mid-range phone right now, the Galaxy A55 is a solid choice. What are your thoughts on the Exynos 1580? Are you excited about the potential performance boost? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tech updates. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Take care.